Catheter balloon user system. This is fully on our machine for the image of our catheters and balloons. So here you can see we have dedicated ports for catheters and dedicated ports for balloons. We have 12 number of catheter ports and 8 number of balloon ports. For attaching the catheter, it's push and twist mechanism. You simply have to push and twist the catheters. We have to keep in mind we have to connect the catheters from top to bottom. That is from C1 to C6. And we will not leave any port empty. We will attach the catheter in both the ports. Right. After attaching catheter, there are dedicated grooves. You simply have to open. put the catheter in the dedicated grooves. So, yeah, the catheter is attached. For balloons, same. It's pushing twist mechanism. These are the balloon ports. Just shift, push, and twist. Okay. The blue ones are the top balloon catheters. ports. Balloons. Yeah, blue ones are the balloons, and white ones are the catheters. Like we do in many folds, push and twist, that is the only technique. So, same after attaching the balloons, you can attach it in the groups. So, total we can attach 12 catheters and 8 balloons. Right now, we have attached only 2 catheters and 4 balloons. So, we will just switch. Close the lid. This is the power button. Simply press it once. So here the machine will show number of catheters. So here you can change the value. From one you can change the value. If you press one, the machine will say change. So here you can select how many catheters you have attached. The value will go up to from 0 to 12 because total number of ports are 12. So right now, see 0, 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12. The value will go up to 12. Right now we have attached two catheters. So we'll select two here and from second we can save. We will save this. Same for the balloons. We can change the value and the, we can select it. The value will go up to 8 because total number of ports are 8. Right now we have attached 4. So we will select 2 and 4. And then we will save. Now the machine is saying catheter 2, balloon 4. From first you can start the cycle. From second you can change the values. If in case you have entered wrong values, you will press change. The machine will ask again. And then you can enter the value. Otherwise we can start the cycle. Just a second. The values so the machine will perform high leak test which is checking balloons for any kind of leakages or damages so here you can see one two three and four are the balloon ports four balloon ports one and two one is to heart means our first port is ready for the use okay. it, it doesn't have any leakages okay. if two is to cross comes then that means our second port is leak so we have to replace the balloon in that in this case it's okay so the machine is starting so in pre-wash what machine is doing machine is uh, this will be the contamination of your catheters and balloons. So, depending on the contamination of catheters and balloons, machine will aspirate chemical. Automatically, it will take chemical. The chemical bottle is attached. So, depending on the contamination of your catheters and balloons, the machine will aspirate chemical. So, if I am saying the full cycle is of 20, with the help of pressure, three types of pressure, the machine is cleaning the catheters. That is turbulent flow, uh, prosthetic flow, and lamellar flow. With these type, three types of flows, the machine is cleaning catheters. And for balloons, what we are doing is, with the help of pressure, we are inflating the balloon. And with the help of vacuum, we are deflating the balloon. So inflation and inflation is going on in the cycle. So here also you can see the animation of balloon here. So this is the inflation stage and this is the deflation stage. Okay. So vacuum is generated in the balloon right now. So once it will inflate, it will also show the animation here, the inflation deflation, the going on. Because that is due to the catheters and balloons are not properly cleaned, they will absorb liquid gas due to the stress of sterilization, which can take liquid oxygen in patients, resulting high hypertension. Right. One cycle is how many minutes? 20 minutes. In ideal cases, 20 minutes only, but sometimes it's 20 minutes. So, minimum we can say that it approximates half an hour. 25 minutes is the perfect time. Do we have any quick session or anything, or it's a regular? Sir, it's a minimum cycle is this only. Minimum cycle is this only. Okay. 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 Okay.
what about the solution how do we get, how we can change that so basically solution is uh, automatically if you take the chemical so when the solution will be low now here only you can see the uh, you can say on the screen will say low chemical okay so simply you have to remove the bottle from here this is silicon this pipe one, this one yes so you can take it out you can take out the silicon pipe and insert the new bottle okay. then each bottle you will get one chip this chip okay so you just have to insert the chip and what i have done uh, right can now can you show the chip i will share you the video as well Uh, from the RO system, then it will be fine. Suppose, yeah. R, suppose R is empty. 
What is the volume of uh, water that uh, uses from this? One cycle, sir. Approximately uh, 70 liters. 70 ml, that is 10 ml. On an average, I am seeing. Yes, it is. Because the bandage press is important. So, if you are not do, if you will not do the bandage press only, you will simply get acid catalyst here. Let the machine will slow the stream rate of water and all the blood will come out of the machine. But actually, it is suggested that uh, do a primary flush outside and then take it. Yes, from that is the protocol that you have to do. Because otherwise, the chemical will be consumed more and your machine will be also mainly with blood and all. There is no point of that. If I say on an average per case, 3 capital 3 kilograms is opening. So, 20 to 3, 60, 60, 120. If I take the number 120. 120 items? Items. At the max. Per day. 1 million. Ah. So, in one cycle, you can take 20. So divided by 20, so it will only say 4 to 5 cycles per day. And if one cycle if I take say half an hour time, so 2 to 3 hours of working with this And your full day load will be completely free with the volume of 120 items. Yes, the volume of 120, 120 items. The same day you can give your articles to ETO and next day you can open the same. Secondly, it will also increase the life of the balloon cell as well. Because we know that after every use, the inner wall of the balloon is damaged. And more and more, more contrast is stuck to the inner wall, making it difficult to clean. So, Does it use hot water or regular uh, cold it is water? Hot water. Hot water. Yes. It won't warm it up. Just uh, whatever it comes in. Uh, yes, yes, yes. Is that enough? Yes, it's enough. Because mm -hmm. of the vibration technique and the pressures we are using. Because manually, <laughs> uh, man, whenever we do manually. Generally, can we use hot water for yes. pressure depression? Just because sir, we are cleaning it with the help of a syringe. Yeah. Okay. In the help of syringe, the pressure won't be much enough. Yes, the pressure and the water and the vacuum is also not enough. But here, we are using the machine, the pressure pump is there and vacuum pump is there. So, in patient depression, is doing in a systematic way and in a, you can say, systematic much better way. Yeah. In a much better way. So, making the inner wall damage less, it will increase the life of the field. Because the inner wall will be damaged less and it will reduce more. Uh, sir, in Tilangana area, Medical Hospital, uh, Hyderabad, Kim's Hospital, uh, Hyderabad, Kondapur, mm -hmm. we have installed already three machines there. And uh, in Kim's Vizag also, we are planning to install. Mm -hmm. And we'll do this final stage of the people. We are installing in Kim's Vizag. And uh, now we are exploring this area. All over, if you talk about India, in Bangalore, we have our installations in Delhi and say all the major corporates we are already serving the Ranta group, Fortis group, Max group, mm -hmm. NH. And uh, coming out to governments also, you can see ESI Hospital, St. John's and Martha in Bangalore, PJ Chandigarh. Mm -hmm. SGPJ right now, all of them we are We are in places in you can say 15 plus years. How old is this? Like, um, so the company is old 6 years. 6 years. Yeah. It's a data funded. It's all good. What is the bit? It's very good sir. Trust me, we have, have given the demonstration of, of this product. We have procured the mm -hmm. And we have, we have managed to get the closures from the various big groups as well. The big companies like Vedanta Group, Vedanta Rakhna, Vedanta Patna, Vedanta Gurgaon, all the things that are using the machine. The same goes for man. Supply is only from Delhi or it is located from Delhi. We don't have any distributor.